Hi guys, so I curate this map, as you can see, looks beautiful and room smooth. So I'm going to show to you my wireframe and LOD. All the terrain was made using Word Machine and the expert UBJ and bring to Unreal. So I scaled a lot this map to create this environment. The terrain was very basic, but I could export and use the LOD system from UE4. I'm gonna hit play. As you can see, everything looks very nice. You could use this to make flying games or something. If you get close, you're gonna see the pixel, so it's is ugly but from far distance this looks great so this far I gonna bring to you uh, my material so it's very basic just an albedo normal map and constant values for metallic in roughness but this is just OBJ 40,000 triangles and this was export from word machine so here you can see the my word machine i made this totally here this is a very basic terrain i'm gonna show to you other nodes this was my first terrain and then i i clamp these values and multiply with this so these details goes, go mixed with this and this was my result. So after that I create my erosion. I'm gonna click on. Here you can see my old, original and then after the erosion. So very basic, just this just these nodes and the other nodes is just for texturing a lot was for test but I'm gonna show to you let me disable this was my mask but this was my grass texture based with uh, image so I combine some nodes to have this result. And then I add the sand with this mask. After I add my rock layer and the final result was, was this. So my resolution was very low but this was for just testing purpose. Then I bring to UE4 on my screenshot save. So as you can see, and looks great. This could be used with the terrain. So this was be display in other parts of the map. I just copy and paste a lot just for testing, but I like my results, so I'm gonna bring this to you. I will show to you the the mesh LOD. So you can see it's very seamless transition. I will move. And this was my last LOD. I'm gonna show to you my, my lit. So as you can see, not so noticeable except the edges.
but this was because I I create this LOD directly from static mesh. So I uh, down here I put the numbers of LODs I want, and then I I change here and. This was the screen size for LOD0, LOD1, 